What's going on, guys? Etika from the Etika World Network here, and in a somewhat unforeseen move, Nintendo announces that there's going to be a Direct specifically focused on Pokemon in two days. Now, there's a lot to take into account with this whole thing. There's plenty of things that Pokemon has been building up to over time. As we all know, Pokemon Tournament is basically about to come out. The game is pretty goddamn hyped from a lot of people. I still need to experience that hype for myself before I can say that I'm excited for the game. I need to actually play it, engage with it, see how the mechanics work. There are some people that were able to do so at certain preview locations, not me though, but anyways, we have Pokken on the side, then we also have Pokemon Go, which is one of the titles that I'm anticipating big time. I know more information about Pokemon Go was going to be revealed at the GDC, but currently we don't really know for a fact if anything about it is going to be talked during this Nintendo Direct, but of course, obviously, let's not dilly-dally, let's not play no games, we all know damn well, one of the biggest, most hype things right now is a new Pokemon game in the main flagship title series, whatever you may want to call it. Now, people are saying maybe it won't be a new generation, let's not forget we do have that new Pokemon, Megiana? Meg Meg Megalovania? I don't I can't remember its exact name, but um we did have that Pokemon which was revealed earlier this month in the Coral Coral update. So it's kind of hard to tell exactly. Will this be a new gen specifically, or will it just be another Pokemon added on to the sixth? Honestly, I first I was thinking to myself, because I, I said this in the YouTube comments on my previous video, dudes, isn't it a little bit too soon for a new gen? But considering the pattern that the last generation came along with, these gens aren't really lasting as long as they were initially, you know? So I mean with less time in between the games means of course a smaller generation so if gen 7 was announced now and by the time it comes out at the end of the year it basically would be the same amount of time that it took for the transition from gen 5 to gen 6 so when you look at the numbers in that sense it makes sense that they would announce a seventh gen for now so this is the information after talking to you dudes in the comments that got me hyped because now it makes more sense it's more likely definitely way more possible that megiana megiana megana I mean, I, I don't know if the pronunciation on that is exactly correct coming from me, but I mean, Megiana is definitely probably a highly chance 7th gen Pokemon. Now, I want to know what you guys have to think about this whole thing, because in two days, we're going to be finding out a lot more information. Now, of course, like I, if you want to know where my bets are, definitely 7th gen, but you know me, I always aim for the clouds with my bets, don't I? Including a certain one that involved my nuts, which is definitely going to be delivered upon. Um, please be patient, I'm trying to figure things out with this channel stuff. But I mean, I'm always in a state of transition, though. You guys know me. Still, what is going to be the deal? What is going to be revealed? Or could, maybe it could be something else entirely. But right now, currently, the only thing I can think of is maybe Pokémon DLC or maybe some, some other characters, some extra characters in Pokémon. Even though the game is pretty much close to being out right now. I know some people have their hands on review copies, like Rasbowski and whatnot. Um, Pokémon Go, that's another big focus. Although I'm not really sure if information will be revealed during this Direct for it. And then finally, a new game. And even if it isn't a game within the seventh generation, any new game, I guess, main series type title that even if it is still in 6th gen even though I won't be as hyped for it I know a lot of other people will be so we'll see what will the new 6th gen game bring if it's not truly another generation it'll probably just bring a lot of new mega evolutions but I don't know man I mean I, I, I can't find myself getting excited about something else in the 6th gen but that's just me hopefully you're not in the same sour boat but they have it all set up, dude. Obviously, as you can see, the Nintendo Direct page has been taken over by Pokemon. We saw Smash Focus Directs. Now we're getting a Pokemon focused one. We saw other mini Directs, but this one looks like it's going to be pretty goddamn big. Huge information. And of course, it's all done in, commemor um, in commemoration commemoration of the new, um, well, not new, but the 20th anniversary of Pokemon this year. So considering that it's the big 2-0 you know for a fact that, that game freak that the pokemon company are definitely going to pull something big and that's why i'm saying obviously the biggest bets have to be for seventh gen but you dudes let me know exactly where your thoughts are what do you anticipate that this nintendo Direct is going to reveal on the 26th of february and of course you all gotta ask no goddamn questions you know for a fact your boy is going to be streaming that bitch i'm going to be giving you guys my live reaction to the whole thing like I said previous times, 
I'm not as into Pokemon as I was before, but if it turns out to be a new generation, then I'm all for it, man. I would love to encounter some new Pokemon, have a new adventure, something with a new perspective. I don't mind. Either way, guys, let me know what you think about this whole thing in the comments and in the straw poll that I'll link below as well. I really want to see where the general population of my channel is leaning towards in terms of what they think this is going to be. I'll be interacting with you dudes in the comments as well, too, and I will talk to you guys in the next video. I think the Undertale playthrough is going to go up, the Final Genocide one. And I also have Fire Emblem Fates, which I'm going to have probably shipped to me by today, the special edition. And maybe I'll start playing it in a live stream later on today. I fixed my capture card as well, too. So we should be fine in that end. I'll see you dudes then. There's going to be a lot of events, too. And um, hopefully, if you guys have been keeping up with the live streams, um, you're, you're keeping up with um, all the kind of cool stuff that I'm trying to do there to change it up a bit. But anyways, see you dudes later on. See you in two days. Well, I'll probably see you sooner than that. But two days, definitely, we will be streaming our reactions to this whole thing. It happens at 7 a.m. Pacific time. So that is around uh, 11 a.m. my time. Um, or around 10 a.m. rather, because it's three hours. So yeah, so 10 a.m. my time. And um, yeah, I, that, I don't know. I mean, it seems a little bit early for a Nintendo Direct, but I don't know. It makes sense. Like, what time is it? What, what day would that be on? The 26th would be on a Friday. So it makes sense, I suppose. It's close to the weekend, although there have been Directs that have been on Stranger Days. All right, this is basically it. You now know the time, you know the date, and you know the theme. I'll see you dudes there.